Oh, Nick Jr., you were supposed to air preschool aim programming, but instead, you aired shows that didn't fit your demographic over the years, including movies. And among them are these. Like the fact that you decide to air Mysticons on elementary school hours despite the fact that this show is kinda dark. Or that Regal Academy got burned off on its second season on Sunday mornings with no advertising whatsoever. Or airing Alvin and the Chipmunks of all shows. But of course, I can't forget the show that you gave surprisingly good treatment and then decide to remove it to not air its third season. And of course, that being Cuckoo Harajuku. The fact that you aired this series on Friday nights after an airing of Paw Patrol when a season 2 premiere and treated the show well as well as giving it weekday reruns and removing those reruns weeks before the season finale and after the season finale you got rid of it and then you aired it on the Nick Jr. Pluto TV channel which only had season 1 and that was gone too with no season 3 until YouTube. But there is another channel that does air non preschool aim programming despite being aimed towards preschoolers and that being Family Junior in Canada. Family Junior in Canada is a preschool aim network just like Nick Junior and it has aired some shows such as Alvin and the Chipmunks and an original by family standards given that it's owned by Wild Brain Polly Pockets. And they have been airing Polly Pocket for quite some time, ever since its premiere, and it kept going with its later seasons. When you see Polly Pocket, you see it on Family Junior when, you're, when it's in Canada. It's sometimes on Family Channel, but most of the time, it does air on Family Junior, including their premieres. Nick Jr., did some pretty good treatment on Kuku Harajuku, but it didn't do the best. I would say this, it got better ratings there on on Nick Jr. than it did on Nickelodeon with its first season, burning off the series after half of season one, airing out of order. Family Jr. apparently also aired Mighty Mike, which is known on Universal Kids in the U.S., but it has aired Mighty Mike before as well. There are some other examples like TG airing Lolly Rock and even a cartoon Nito feed airing Totally Spies of All Things. Given that Nick Jr. was trying to gear towards females, which was why they were burning off those shows there than on Nicktoons, which they were trying to make Nicktoons a boy-centric network with Nick Sports, which seems kinda unfitting there. I really don't like where some of those Beyonders call Kuku Harajuku a toddler version of Hi Hi Puppy Yami Yui, despite the fact that it's by the same demographic and it has the same rating. It was just burned off there because, well... Nickelodeon didn't treat their animated shows back in the 2010s, and yeah. I gotta say, Family Junior is treating Polly Pocket well to this day with their airings. Some of them being on like Saturday mornings and some days being weekdays at primetime hours. Anyway guys, this is Kawaii Life Antonio, signing up. Peace.